So this is the lead up and promotion for the Automoto event. We're actually doing an Automoto event on May 18th at the Lloyd Erskine Sandiford Center. But this is kind of the precursor, the come out, drift your cars, have fun, drink some beer, enjoy yourself. The guys were out there just a second ago sliding the cars and having a ton of fun. We've got videos going on, we've got people liming, chilling. It's essentially fun around cars and getting ready for Automoto. I'm thinking of having one at the event at Frisky Friday. Uh, that's the day before the model, just to get everybody in tight frame of mind. Uh, everybody we just wanted to come out and practice. Practice, practice is the name of the game. And funny enough, we've got right behind us Dibbles, Dylan Foster, who is actually our reigning champion of Automoto. Dibbles! This year at Automoto, we're going to be doing a number of events, not just the drifting, not just the dexterity, but this year is going to be a drift line. Drifting, dexterity, most importantly, we've got, we've got the freestyle competition, which means you take your car out, you show us what you can do, and then the crowd will be the judge. We've also got the, the go-karting, which, which is going to be an actual full day of go-karting, and then most importantly, our thrill ride. Thrill ride has been a signature edition from the beginning of Automoto. We have a driver, take you out, spin you, have a great time. Listen guys, if you miss this, you are missing the baddest car event this year. Baddest. Baddest. And not to say our partner, the organizers of this event are BAD, Barbados Association of Dragsters and Drifters. So the typical automoto has about 25 cars. This year we're expecting between 30 and maybe 40 cars. We run a number of different events. One is going to be a complete time attack. The second one is actually elimination. So you get you know first round, second round competition, and then you're completely eliminated but you decide which one we're going to do. So when you come out to Automoto, we're going to make the choice available and then we're going to run that selection. I just want to say, at Automoto as well, we, we totally plan to transform the Loiter Skin Center Center. We actually want to have an old car versus new car face off. We're having the rally cars, we're having Barrel coming out, having the mud dogs. We plan to have one of the biggest displays of cars ever seen in Barbados. That's the plan. And don't forget we've got the wall of smoke. We unleashed the wall of smoke last year. The wall of smoke was a burnout that has never been seen in this island. We had maybe 12 to 15 cars smoke the tires. When we were finished we actually smoked past the asphalt. Rubber. The asphalt went straight through to the underlying subsurface. You don't want to miss this. This is the baddest thing. And of course we've got one other surprise, our finale. That's not going to be our finale yet this year. That's going to be one of the things that we do. Our finale is going to be massive, guys. Massive. Always something different on Automoto. Automoto started off around a, around a table. There's a bunch of guys who love drifting cars, sitting down and having a, a big idea and, 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 and executing it. When we first came out, the sponsors, I would say sponsor was kind of, you know? Yeah, non-existent, but when people saw the product, when people saw Automoto, when people saw what we could do, when people saw the drivers, when year two, it just it just took off. It was it was fantastic. And and this year it's even it's even bigger. So from small beginnings we just we just got bigger and bigger. I think Corey would has said it all. First year was really, really difficult to raise sponsorship, but of course nobody knew the event. The second year it was in some sense, some of the sponsors said it was a no-brainer. They were in it. And this year, the conversation started much earlier. We were able to get our, our core group. We actually slimmed down the sponsorship group and we've got some fantastic sponsors on board. What I want to say to that is all the sponsors that are supporting us this year really, really have made a big effort to push and be a part of the event. And we really appreciate that. This year's Automotive is going to be a smaller, much more focused event focusing on the large car park at Lloyd Erskine Sanford Center as opposed to the two car parks which split the event. We are challenging everybody to come out and really give your best. It is going to be non-stop action. You're going to enjoy it. Right. We'll see you at Automoto May 18th, Lloyd Erskine Sanford Center from 2 to there. 10 p.m. Got to be there. Boom. Out.